What's up, everybody? Good Rooster 55 here. Just got done watching uh, the Lady Commodores fall uh, very badly to the Yukon Huskies, the number one seed, 44 to 77. One hell of a team Yukon is. I don't like Gino Oriema. Seems like a jerk. He is really a jerk. But, uh, doors fell. Uh, we ran it for the first 15 minutes, but something that really got me was that it was a seven-point game with three minutes remaining in the first half. And the woman's, co the woman's commentator said, I just don't think Vanderbilt will have enough to win it. It's a seven-point game, lady. And there's three points, and there's three minutes left in the first half. It's just a seven-point game, and you're going to go ahead and say that, say that. But I guess she knows more than me because it ended up being a freaking blowout. Uh, it seems like we quit trying, you know. I don't get why we don't drive it in the lane more. That's something that just gets me. There are a couple bad calls, I believe. Uh, maybe that's just me being biased. and You know, no wonder why a lot of people don't come on here and talk about women's basketball. You know, because, well... I don't know. It's just frustrating. We shot like 30%. It was pitiful. Probably worst. Probably worse than 30% uh, by the end of the game. Uh, but uh, thanks to Tiffany Clark and all the other seniors for sticking with VU. Uh, sad that it has to go out in a blowout and we couldn't go down swinging. But uh, even at the end, you know, I, I get it. We know we're going to lose. But why don't we drive it in the lane, you know? Inbounded it to our big center, I think. Instead of driving it in the lane, which she could have easily done, draw a foul. She shot a jump shot, and it went to the left and was just way off. So, you know, even then, near the end of the game, it's like we just didn't care. We just wanted to get this game over with, which I get that. We, get, we just got our asses handed to us on a silver platter. But come on. I mean, drive it in the lane. And our passing was off all night. UConn's passing was off all night. All night. That was something surprising to the commentators that UConn's passing was off all night. But uh, they ended up picking up steam and beating the hell out of us. But our passing was just honestly kind of scary bad. Not good at all tonight. But uh, that's how it's going. In. Second round. Melanie Balcom's a good basketball coach. Uh, she just couldn't get that message through the door's head. When it went to halftime and we couldn't ever get back in it. Uh, I'm glad to have her as our coach for this 11th season. And uh, looking forward to next season. Uh, young team. Looking good for future seasons. Just got to keep that faith for the Commodores. And uh, yeah. Order 55 out. Disappointing way to end the season, but that's how it went down. And uh, congrats to UConn. Uh, couldn't shoot, couldn't pass, and that's why it was a blowout. But uh, some bright seasons ahead, I believe, for uh, the Lady Doors.